In this video, I will be showing you how to create the leg drawing for your footstool project. Start by inserting the front view of your leg. The scale of the inserted view should be one to three or one third of its original size. Place the front view to the left side of your drawing sheet. Then project the right side view followed by a projection of the view of the back side of the part. Once all three views are placed, right click on each view and show hidden lines. It's important to show the hidden lines on a product, product like this as there's multiple features that show hidden lines. Once that's done, we're going to add center lines. Use the center line tool and add center lines to the holes that are shown in the right side view. We'll use the edge to edge center line tool for this and place a center line on both the counter bores. These center lines will have to be drug beyond the face of the part. Once those are placed, we'll go over to these other holes. We'll add center lines to these as well. Use the center line tool and place a two point center line from the center of the bottom edge of the center of the hole to the top edge of the part. We're placing the center line here on this view as this is the view we're going to locate these pocket holes from. From here, we can start dimensioning. Use the ordinate dimension tool to dimension the bottom edge of the part. We're placing a dimension to show the location of the arc, the center of the part, the other side of the arc, and the overall width. Then use the ordered dimension tool again, going from that same corner and reference the center of the holes and the top edge of the part. Once completed with that, we can drag these views and move them around so that they're easy to see. Then dimension the counter bore using the whole call out. And note that there's two holes that need to be drilled for this part. Once completed with that, we can put in the overall thickness of the part. Note the total amount of fillets needed, and that's 10. <clears throat> Place the radius of the arc. and dimension, excuse me, the center of each of the pocket holes. And we're showing that these are two inches from the edge and directly center on the part. The final step is to annotate the grain direction. which should go from the top to the bottom of the part. Again, delete the dimension and type in grain. There's a note on the bottom edge of the packet. You can also add in this note in order to show that these eighth inch fillets are needed. This concludes all of the steps required for drawing 
the leg in Onshape. If you have any questions on creating this drawing page, make sure to ask.